We are here in Reddington Beach, Florida at Coastal Pizza. We actually found this place um, during the pandemic. We just came to this area to walk around and have been wanting to come here since. So it's been over a year that this has been on our bucket list. We're finally here. It is Friday before a holiday weekend. It's Memorial Day on Monday. So we are just kicking off the long weekend the right way. We're gonna have some good pizza, got some good drinks. We are here to have a good time. We're here at Coastal Kitchen and this is the motel right next door and I'm not gonna lie, that pool looks pretty inviting. What? Coastal Pizza Kitchen has both indoor and outdoor seating and we love the atmosphere of both. It's a little bit more of an upscale pizza place than your typical run of the mill pizza place. We ordered shrimp bruschetta and please don't come after me for that pronunciation. I watched several YouTube videos to master that pronunciation. It seems like everyone has a little bit of a different opinion on how to pronounce that. <laughs> but anyways, that's what we ordered as an appetizer. You can see it right here. It was really good. Then for pizza, Mitchell got the whole damn thing, which he'll talk about a little bit later. He did substitute the barbecue sauce for the regular, and I got the yard bird pizza, which was really good. We each right, got guys. the smaller so size, which was 12 beers. inches, and I think pizza next time we'll here. share a pizza because it was a lot of food, which actually is a really right, good thing. Second and third beers. Pizza is here. What'd you get again? Uh, I got the whole damn thing. Uh, which is like everything that they offer as far as meat goes. Pretty much it's like an all meat pizza, but uh, it turns out this place is like an Italian place. It's uh, It's got like capicola, it's got, uh, uh, I obviously like bacon, but, uh, pepperoni. Uh, what's the other one? Uh, it starts with the uh, prosciutto. Uh, prosciutto, that's what it is. Uh, prosciutto, real, uh, real cheesy. Uh, you know, great flop on the uh, <laughs> flop factor. Uh, you know, crust looks amazing. I'm gonna go ahead and try it. Mm. Fantastic pizza, <laughs> honestly. Yay! Really good. Uh, give it probably like an 8.4. 8.4 is high. You know, a lot of guys say that, but it's pretty good. So it's, it's a good. winner. I got a different kind of pizza. Do you remember the name of mine? The Yardbird? Yeah, I think yeah. you're right. And I haven't tried it yet, so I'm gonna try it now. But mine has chicken and onion and jalapeno. So, yeah. Go. Okay, so I already ate one slice and I'm supposed to rate it, but I don't know if I'm gonna do as good as the Barstool guy or as Mitchell. What's the Barstool guy's name? Uh, Dave Portnoy. And it is Barstool, right? Yeah, Barstool Sports, okay, yeah. So what am I supposed to rate? The uh, flop, yeah, yeah, you get it rate flop. So you flop say one one bite, everybody knows the rules. Oh, wow, what a phenomenal flop yeah. rating there. Yeah, Look yeah. How thick that is. Yeah. It's like a good size. Yeah, man, yeah, that's thick as source. So I made Mitchell, I didn't mention this, but I made Mitchell order this, like, huge pizza. Way too Monster big. size. This is the 12 inch, that's the 16. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm still going to have leftovers. But... Oh, yeah. Okay, so flop is great. Flop is great. Everyone knows the rules, one bite. Yeah, yeah. But take, I took a no, slice. you didn't. No, you didn't. Uh, just take one bite off the end, and then you gotta bite the crust too, I think. Okay. Yeah. One bite there, and be like, oh man, that's good. Throw it down. Be like, Frankie. Frankie, that's crazy. Say it. Is that guy Frankie? That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. Is that guy's car getting broken into? <laughs> it looks like it. Oh man. Doesn't that always happen? Yeah, something crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just kidding. No one's <laughs> getting broken into. I feel like that always happens in these videos. Yeah, yeah. But anyway. Now take one bite of the crust. First time ever. Never had the crust before here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. What's it like? It's great. Tell Frankie how good it is. Who's Frankie? Uh, his cameraman. Oh. Frankie, some <laughs> great pizza. You gotta come to Coastal Pizza. I keep wanting to call it Coastal Kitchen. Coastal, coastal Pizza, pizza. Kitchen, yeah. It's 
it's really good. But really, all jokes aside, it really is an amazing pizza. Beer's good. I'm having this St. Pete Brewing Company orange wheat ale. Pretty good. Mitch is having a good old. This is Bud Light. Oh, Bud Light. But it's only yeah. what two dollars here because we're here for happy hour. Yeah, from three to six, it's uh, two fifty Bud Lights. I love a cheap date. We don't typically do entire videos on just one restaurant and part of that is because I just don't consider myself to be a foodie. I'm kind of intimidated by that title or that word as, you know, as evidenced by not being confident in my pronunciation of bruschetta. <laughs> So anyways, this was just kind of something new and something different. Um, I don't know if I'm a foodie, but I do love, you know, trying new restaurants and things like that. So if you liked this video on just kind of one restaurant, let me know. Or if you kind of prefer videos to be a little bit of a mix of like a day in this town or that town or wherever we are, I'm happy to do that as well. On this day, this was the only thing that we did. We had dinner here and then we went to the store super exciting so that's also part of why this video is just um one thing one restaurant so anyways if you found this to be helpful if you decided that this is a place you'd like to visit because of our video consider hitting that thumbs up button it would mean a lot to us and it would also mean a lot to us if you could hit that subscribe button we will see you next time. Thank you so much for watching.